Hey guys, Crew of Blind Wave, I'm Eric. I'm Calvin. Aaron. And we're here with a new movie reaction this time. Goodfellas. Good people at patreon.com slash blindwave helped us pick a movie uh, from a poll that was supposed to be just... I can't believe Eric hasn't seen this movie. And I went down a list of like some of the best movies of all time. What have I seen? What have I haven't? Picked five, put it on there, and Goodfellas won. And turns out... Not everybody has seen this movie. Yeah. <laughs> no, like everything on the list I hadn't seen. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Aaron, you haven't seen Goodfellas at all. I haven't seen Goodfellas at all. No, I was saying before this, because Rick has seen it and stuff, and I was like, I don't know like anything about this movie. He's like, I'm sure you know something about it. Yeah. He's like, well, it's like a 90s mob kind of movie. Yeah. And there's like several of those. But I don't know which ones are which, because I never watched like any of them. Yeah, I think like, that I, I, I know, know Goodfellas versus like Godfather versus like... Yeah. I don't know, Departed. Like, I think that's kind of mobbish or something, right? I don't know what that is either. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen that one either. I haven't seen <laughs> it. Seen I, I no. thought it was a horror movie. Sounds I, like a horror movie. I mentioned a long time ago, you guys said, don't watch it. So I didn't watch it. Did she fall funny? <laughs> <laughs> I love that movie. <laughs> All right, uh, and Calvin, you said you... I've seen some of it. Some of it? Yeah. Okay. Like, I think that I've uh, absorbed, like, references and stuff to various things, because it's a very popular movie. And sure. I might know, like, a line or, or two. Um... But Just through osmosis. We were watching an episode of Community, and I felt like, I think this is a Goodfellas thing, but I don't remember right now. Yeah. <laughs> so, or I don't know, because I never actually sat down to watch the movie like I'm doing right now. And you can also sit down, watch the entire movie along with us. Uh, if you go down to the description or the pinned comment, you can find a link to our full-length reaction, which, if you don't know, over at patreon.com slash blindwave, there are ways uh, and rewards for you to support us, and one of those rewards is the full-length reaction, where you can sync up your own version. We're watching this off of Netflix, and uh, watch the entire thing along with us, and I say that especially because this is a very long movie. It is. Yeah. It's two and a half hours long. Two and a half hours long, so we can't possibly fit all the good stuff into our highlight. We do our the absolute best, though, stuff. but you can also check out the full length, the, the good. <laughs> Shit. Now, is that true? They could be lying. No, you no, can't, they you never can't lie. say that and lie. They can. They say it's based on... True events. So, some of these things did happen, but not exactly how they happened. New York is in New York City, or New York is in New York State? City. Look how young everyone is. I know. <laughs> it's crazy. Wait, were they gonna? I mean, that's a show. Bury someone, but they're not dead. Or do they not know there's someone in their trunk? Why does he got a shovel? I mean, it's the first thing that you said. That is a knife. That was a knife. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Jesus. Shooting into the car. Get him out first. Now your spare is a flat. As far back as I can remember, I always wanted to be a gangster. I've heard that. I've heard that, right? I've heard that line before. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. I don't think I've seen very much stuff that he's in, so. So he ran the cab stand and the Bella Vista Pizzeria and a few other places for his brother Paul, who was the boss. Got a cigar. Be careful. Yeah, you get burned. Hey, Paulie. Paulie might have moved slow. But it was only because Paulie didn't have to move for anybody. <laughs> I was the luckiest kid in the world. I could go anywhere. I could do anything. I knew everybody and everybody knew me. Why these guys would pull up and Tootie would toss me their keys and let me park their Cadillacs. Cool. And here I am, this little kid, I can't even see over the steering wheel, and I'm parking Cadillacs. <laughs> months. Months. But after a while, he was mostly pissed because I hung around the cab stand. You're gonna fuck everything up. My destiny's gonna kill me. Look. Oh, oh shit. Take, uh, 
Wait, is this the guy that delivered the mail or what? I don't understand. Uh, that's an oven. I thought it was. Know where he lives? Deliver mail to his house? From now on, any letter from that school to that kid's house comes directly here. You understand? Holy shit. Another letter from that school goes to that kid's house. In the fucking oven, you're gonna go ahead first. That was it. No more letters from truant officers, no more letters from school, in fact, no more letters from anyone. <sighs> Is that oven on? There's a pizza in it. He's already fucked. Jeez, I love this guy. Always has a scar. He does. <laughs> in the rain. You wouldn't have one in his house. People looked at me differently. They knew I was with someone. Oh my god. What's he doing? Have to wait in line at the Whose cars are these? Why? Someone's upset. It looks like a dealership, maybe? I don't know. I mean, I had more money than I could spend. I had it all. Great shot. Love it. Yep. And these freeze frames are so interesting. Look at my shoes, aren't they great? Right? My God. You look like a gangster. Aw, thanks, Mom. Oh, shit. That was the first time I'd ever seen anyone shot. <laughs> Was he just randomly shot on the street? Mm -hmm. Just some dude. Maybe somebody who had protection. See, Jimmy was one of the most feared guys in the city. He was first locked up at 11 and he was doing hits with mob bosses when he was 16. Yes. Yeah, it's never bothered Jimmy. And almost all of them were gimmies. I mean, they just gave it up. Loves the steal. Mm -hmm. They called him Jimmy the Jim. <laughs> The drivers loved them. They used to tip them off about their really good load. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. Well, yeah, they get yeah, they get money. So get him out of here. Get him out. No, no, you don't understand. You don't understand. He clothes. bailed. Oh, well, okay. he going for him. Okay. I thought he just took off. <laughs> Kind of goes hand in hand. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like the same thing. <laughs> Jeez. Everybody's so proud of him. Freddy no knows. He has one. And then there was That's the joke. killer who was Sally Balls' brother. I took care of that thing for him. <laughs> I took care of that thing for him. Uh, and Jimmy two times, who got that nickname because he said everything twice, like... I'm gonna go get the papers, get the papers. Get the papers, get the papers. <laughs> Hey, the guy. Security. 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 I wish I was big just once. <laughs> he's remarkably small, but he's so like intimidating, huge in personality. Yeah. You're too funny. I mean, so I understand that. Maybe it's a little fucked up, maybe. But I'm funny. How? I mean, funny like I'm a clown, and you you. Make you laugh. I'm here to fucking amuse you. What do you mean funny? Funny? How? I'm funny. How the fuck am I funny? What the fuck is so funny about me? Tell me. Tell me what's funny. Tell me. Tell me. Get the fuck out of here. 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 Whole restaurant's laughing. <laughs> what the I've never hell, seen man? someone laugh harder. What is he laughing like that? He's <laughs> laughing so hard. You know anything about this fucking restaurant business? He knows everything about it. I mean, he's in the joint 24 hours a day. I mean, I never, 
Another fucking you know, few minutes, he could be a stool. That's how tall often he's in. Another <laughs> few minutes, he could be a stool. <laughs> Now the guy's got to come up with poles. That's a cool money. shot. Mm -hmm. No matter what, as soon as the deliveries are made in the front door, you move this stuff out the back and sell it at a discount. <laughs> you take a two hundred dollar case of booze and you sell it for a hundred. She don't want to go out with Italians, huh? She's prejudiced against Italians. Fucking believe that. In this day and age, what the fuck is this world coming to? He's so progressive. <laughs> I can't believe this prejudice against a Jew boy. Prejudice against Italians. Anyway, she won't go out with me alone. Unless a girl comes with us, so I figure you come along and all the door. I'm trying to find this fucking boy. Help me out. <laughs> I don't know how to teach you. He's just waiting for this building to burn down. Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> I couldn't stand him. Oh, I thought he was really noxious. He kept fidgeting around. Of course, when Friday night came around, and he stood me up. I felt terrible. I don't know where he is. You know, he really liked you, too. What you want to do is talk about her, you know? We were a trio instead of a double date that <laughs> night. I hope it's something serious. That's what I'm worried about. He's such a bullshitter. I know. Made Tommy take me looking for him. You got no nerve standing, Mia. Nobody does that to me. Who the hell do you right. think you are? Frankie Valley or some kind of big shot? <laughs> <laughs> He's getting his ass chewed off. It was Friday, it was this Friday, and you agreed, so you're a liar. That's fine. We can talk about this, all right? Make it easy. Talk about it? Talk to you after what you just did to me. Forget it. I'm not talking to you about it. I thought you were going to stand me up. You look forward. You can say anything. What do you expect? Hmm? Let me wake up. Harry. I'll think of it. Uh, yeah, she's screaming on the street, and I mean loud, but she looked good. Yep. Now he's interested. Yep. They brought a table. She brought a table, yeah. Yep. All the other tables are full, and they're not going to move a guest. Don't worry, we got a table for you. Right in the front. <clears throat> Look at that. That's service. Plug the light in. <laughs> there you go. It's such a tiny table. Yeah, it's for two. Only two people, and it's a it's a show hall. That table's not big enough for me to get food. <clears throat> this table ain't big enough for the two of us. It's a fancy place. They're probably tiny plates. This, the is key. The, this is for the yep. cash, right? Here's the key. From France. Air France, baby. We walked out with four hundred and twenty thousand dollars without using it. Wow. We did the right thing. We gave Paulie his tribute. No five weeks that come off in the wrong time. <laughs> <laughs> I love these yeah. demonstrative infomercials. Uh, that's a good commercial. Yeah, don't talk about cops. Oh, his wig came off at the wrong time. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Bruce, you're gonna tear that guy apart. He pushed me out of his out of the car. Oh, jeez! Damn! I thought it was gonna be worse, honestly. It was pretty bad. <laughs> Probably collapses like sip of the lobe. Yeah, got away. <laughs> She said, actually, it was the other one. <laughs> and almost all of them were named Peter or Paul. It was unbelievable. <laughs> Petey. <laughs> Two dozen Peters and Pauls at the wedding. 
This is Marie. Plus, they were all married to girls named Marie. <laughs> Marie. And they named all their daughters Marie. Marie. And this is V. No, I mean Paulie. I get confused myself. <laughs> he even messed up with it. <laughs> I love that. What bag? The bag with all the envelopes and all the money. <laughs> Don't worry about that. Who's going to steal that here? Mm hmm. You don't know where he is. You don't know who he's with. He's with his friend, Dad! Will you leave him out of this? He's not going to know. The man who's been able to digest a decent meal in six weeks. Jesus, get out of the house. Right. Why don't they have a place? Why can't he digest food? They have so much money. A married man does not stay out like this. Yeah. Mom! Don't stay out like this! Get out. Come on here. Shut up. She's right. What's wrong with you, Henry? <laughs> He's your bestie, man. She's right. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Mickey said that Jeannie's husband. You know why Jeannie's husband went to the can? Because of Jeannie. Because he wanted to get away from her. That's why. <laughs> he chose jail to get away from her. The only way they could make extra money, real extra money, was to go out and cut a few corners. Where's this curly box, you fucking Take him easy. Don't move. Don't move. Here's your hat, you fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We were all so very close. It got to be normal. It got to where I was even proud these. that I had the kind of husband who was willing to go out and risk his neck. <laughs> I'm pouring water on him. Suits, man. <laughs> Stack about they that. They measure tall. their money like this. Oh my gosh. Just a little bit. Oh, that's <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> Shut up, then. Shut up. Just don't say anything. Uh, don't say anything. Let me get your fucking shine box. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if things with Lisa are going to last. Oh, no. This is the guy that was in the trunk, isn't it? This is the guy that was in the trunk. Broke his gun. Oh. <laughs> He's such a good friend. So considerate. It's Henry's car too? Oh man. <laughs> In my mother's house. I'm gonna shovel. Well, he doesn't have a shovel. That would be suspicious. <laughs> And the guy's in the There's car a guy during this car, whole yeah. time? Yeah. I mean, they think he's dead. She had it right there. Yeah. <laughs> That's great for criticism. I love it. <laughs> guy always has a cigar. Always. What? So they gotta dig him up. What? They're gonna build oh yep. my god! They're gonna build. They're gonna disturb the ground. He's gonna. They're gonna find the body. Dude, he's gonna be rotten. Six, Six months. months. He's gonna be terrible. <laughs> oh my god! 
straighten up her boss a bit. Oh no, oh no. Man, don't play, don't play around. Oh, oh, I hate this. Oh, oh shit. Now he's moving, oh my god. That guy has the biggest ego. Yeah. In the smallest body. <laughs> it's an accident. Fuck him. I'm telling you, I look in your face and I know that you're lying. Get out. Shut up. Oh, he's back. Looks like he doesn't have any toes. But he does have a drink. Bullshit, you. Tell the truth, you're looking for sympathy. Is that it, sweetie? Why don't you go fuck yourself? Fuck this time. I don't believe what I just heard. Hey, Spider, hey. Yeah, this is for you. I don't think Spider's gonna make it very long. No, don't push him more. He's already so fucking. Uh... Oh! Jesus Christ, man. Shoot the guy. Dead. Well, yeah, you shot him in the chest. Are you gonna take the fucking thing? Up? You're gonna take the hole. You're gonna do it. I got no fucking lime. You're gonna. <laughs> I got no lime. Oh my God. She's had that a long time. <sighs> Do you love her? Do you? Pointing right at the camera is such an effective choice. I was still very attracted to him. Oh my god. <laughs> Why should I give him to someone else? Jeez, man. Such a tense scene all around. I'm sorry. Wow. Jesus. Man. They need couples therapy. They need more than that. Fuck this guy. Man, that's what. Damn. You're the Just give us the fucking money, huh? I can't. Yeah, I swear. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my the gosh. Why is there a flamingo? <gasps> oh no. Are they gonna throw him in the lion pit? The Carol Basket. They must really feed each other to the lions down there because the guy gave the money right up. <laughs> and we got to spend the rest of the weekend at the track. Yeah. Then. I couldn't believe what happened. It was really feeding the lines. We got home, we were all over the newspaper. At first, all of the newspaper. I didn't even know why we got picked up. Then I found out that the guy we roughed up turned out to have his sister working as a typist for the FBI. I oh, could believe no. it. Of all the fucking people, she gave up everybody. Jimmy, me, even her brother. Oh, no. It took Man. the jury six hours to bring us in guilty. The judge gave Jimmy and me ten years like he was giving away candy. Years and a federal contract. Damn. Well, Johnny Deal did the meat. <laughs> we didn't have a boiler, so Johnny did everything. They're in jail, right? 
They used to smell yeah, like there's bars the in the windows. Used to die, but he's They're connected. Great steak. Hey, like you know, when you think, you think of prison, you get pictures in your mind of all those old movies with rows and rows of guys behind bars. But it with wasn't ice. like that for wise guys. Who else has been here? Rossi. Mm. These two are a shit show. I don't want to hear a word about her anymore. I was gonna bring her out before. <laughs> just don't look at the books. Yeah, just don't read stuff. Four years, you got out early, huh? <clears throat> yeah. One of them good behavior kind of things. Probably crowding. Good fellas. Four years. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. A lot of food. I'm so hungry. Oh, there's more. Man. I like no, it. lasagna, Eric! Italian lasagna. <laughs> Looking down your nose. <laughs> I needed some help, so I got Jimmy and Tommy to come in with me. Is this for parole? Yep. Oh my god, they're here for their probation. And their they're in drug the high court. Shit. Oh, Look at the size of that TV. I Look know. at that entertainment center. Oh. This is the high of luxury. He used to hang around the lounge and play guitar. Everybody loves stacks. What he was supposed to do was steal the panel truck and afterwards contacted by a friend of ours out in Jersey. Only Maury was driving us nuts. The wig guy? Just because yeah. he set this up, he felt he could bust Jimmy's balls for an advance on the money we were gonna steal. Why anybody bust anybody's balls in this? When balls are busted, people die. Yeah. You will die. <laughs> Pulled it off. That's uh guys flunk. Yeah, he's buying it's his wife. It's a whining fucking bullseye that everybody's watching us. You get a fucking car. It's telling me I'm inside. 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 I
Huh? Huh? You're gonna get paid? We're gonna work for this guy one day. He's gonna get bought. Yep. He's <laughs> gonna be a, a businessman. You just gotta stop busting balls. Everyone who has busted balls is dead. Yeah, sure. Stop. No, mon- no money there. Man, is breaking, ah, breaking balls. balls. Breaking man. balls everywhere. Uh, Bless some balls. Henry's not here. No, nope, he's not. <sighs> Ice pick in the back of his skull. Jesus! Oh, Damn, man. He died so quick. It seemed like they had the best relationship. Mm-hmm. Come on, fuckos, let's go for a ride. <laughs> Keep them up all night. That's the feds, right? Yeah, yeah I think so. They're tailing him. Come on, let's go for a ride. <laughs> That's uh, the pink car. That's that one guy's car. That's the guy's car, yeah. Everybody else that was in the hit. Is he dead too? He, they're both dead. Him and his wife. That's his girlfriend, right? I thought it was his wife. Oh, no. Right? Maybe it is, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because it was a wedding yeah. present. They, they're killing everybody who's involved in the, the score? Yep. Means the guy who got the fur coat. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, the guy oh, with the fur coat. Oh, the hair, no. Man, he's killing everybody. When they found Carbone in the meat truck, he was frozen so stiff it took them two days to thaw him out for the autopsy. Jeez. Still, I never saw Jimmy so happy. <laughs> was like a kid. <laughs> Such a great Jimmy. He's coming in through my Pittsburgh people, and even after a while, I never saw him so happy. Combat. Right? Congratulations, Mr. Watson. I love you. Don't paint any more religious pictures, please. Yeah, the Mona Lisa back there. We always called each other good fellas. Like you say to uh, somebody, you're gonna like this guy, he's alright. Where's his cigar? He's a good fella, he's one of us. You understand? Huh? We were good fellas, God, wise guys. It didn't even matter that my mother was Sicilian. To become a member of a crew, mm. you have to be 100% Italian so they can trace all your relatives back to the old country. I see. Mm-hmm. That makes sense. <laughs> oh, shit. That makes a lot more sense. Why? Why? Because he was a troublemaker. Why is Paulie gonna. He just warned Henry about him before. Pushed over the phone booth. Robin De Niro is so good. There's a truck to steal. Oh. They're really bad for these evil men. It was revenge for Billy Bats. Dude. And a lot of other things. He killed a made, made man. As I was thinking about him when they were talking about being a made man. Yeah. Yeah. Forever. He even shot Tommy in the face, so his mother couldn't give him an open coffin. <sighs> There's a, lot of cars. There's a lot of cars behind him, too. Yeah. He's spiraling, man. Yeah, okay. Seems too coincidental, right? Yeah. He's following him. <laughs> he looks crazy. <laughs> they look crazy. He does. She picks up the phone and calls from the house. Now, if anybody was listening, they'd know everything. <laughs> What a day! But taking it! He's not gonna make it back to dinner. Oh my gosh, all that powder everywhere! <laughs> he left. 
Just on the way out. <laughs> the only thing he didn't say was jackass, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Your fucking hat. Are you kidding me? You should buy me now. It's a trip to Rockaway because you want to get your hat. I need it. I got a habit. Lucky hat. Lucky hat. Lois. She's going to get pinched. I don't care. I need my hat. I mean, <laughs> what could I do? If she insisted, I had to drive her home for her goddamn hat. I had a package in the kitchen and I went to take her home. Is there going to be a warrant? Uh, She's going to sign for it? Maybe. What are those lights? Those are lights. Three, three, three. Oh, fuck! How do you shut it off slowly? They have been wise guys. I wouldn't have heard a thing. Mm. Mm -hmm. be dead. dead. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Watch it. That's where she's gonna try. It. She's gonna plug it. Oh, be careful of the scissors, baby. Oh, 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 your fingers. Gosh. The aftermath. Oh, man. When was the last time you took a collar? Hey, fuckhead, I'm talking to you. You don't wanna say a fucking word to me, you don't have to say anything. Lur, lur, lur. Lur. Got all of it. It's everything at Sandy's place, huh? Yep. I'm gonna make a fucking cake. Is it good? It's pure. <laughs> His face. Karen finally got her mother to put her house up for my bail and I was out. Shush, I love that. I had this feeling I was gonna get killed right outside the jail. Where's the stuff that I got, Karen? Where would she have put it? I think it was wise to not get caught with all of it. Yeah. They, they had everything. I think she made the right choice. Yeah. I don't live life this hard. This is a hard day they're going through. I don't live like this. It's hard to empathize. Jesus. Pinball, Pinball tables, Rick. I was in like a trap. Yeah, it's a trap. I don't trust it's it. Undoubtedly, he's like you. You go around the corner there. You you go. No, keep keep going. Yeah, because he wasn't leading her anymore. You know, it no, felt, didn't feel, he didn't want to be near it. it. Didn't feel right to me either. You think she wants to move now? Yeah. Karen? Karen? <laughs> Jesus. So I met Jimmy in a crowded place we both knew. I got there 15 minutes early and I saw that Jimmy was already there. <laughs> he took the booth near the window so we could see everyone who drove up to the restaurant. He wanted to make sure I wasn't tailed. He was jumpy. He hadn't touched a thing. Jimmy had never asked me to whack somebody before. But now he's asking me to go down to Florida and do a hit with Anthony. This is different. <laughs> That's when I knew I would never have come back from Florida alive. Mm -hmm. And do you mind whenever you move me, I ask you once, and I want to tell you again, I don't want to go any place it's cold. Witness protection? Yeah. He's ratting. Just whoever fucking controls it, just no place cold, all right? Do that for me. I'm trying to I'm doing it. Well, if you legitimately go off, you'll move. <laughs> if it's legitimate. <laughs> I've listened to those boring caps. And I've heard you on a telephone. 
talking about cocaine. Mm. Conversation after conversation, we're talking about cocaine. We picked him up. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter, because whether he goes to jail or whether he stays on the street, he beats the case. He's a dead man. He knows it, you know it. Oh, damn. He went everybody, huh? Please point him out to members of the jury. Your Honor, please let the record reflect that Mr. Hill has identified the defendant, James Conway. Mr. You Hill, do you also rat. know a man by the name of Paul Cicero? Yes. Do you see him here in the courtroom today? Yes. Do you point him out to the members of the jury? Finger him. Uh. Mr. Hill has identified the defendant, Paul Cicero. Your Honor, I have a document that I'd like to have marked. See, the hardest thing for me was leaving the light. I still love the life. And we were treated like movie stars with muscle. We had it all just for the asking. Our wives, mothers, kids, everybody rode along. I had paper bags filled with jewelry stashed in the kitchen. I had a sugar bowl full of coke next to the bed. People call them rats. It's a rat will do anything to survive. Isn't that right, Mr. Hill? Objection. Uh, call him a rat on the stand. Mr. Hill, you know everything about being a rat. Objection, Your Honor. To do with the violence? Didn't matter. Didn't mean anything. When I was broke, I would go out and rob some more. He ran everything. He paid off cops. He paid off lawyers. He paid off judges. <laughs> You're talking to the camera? Everybody yeah. Had their hands out. Everything was he is paid. singing. And now it's all over. That's Man, that's, a, that's been the whole movie. I was yeah, caught off guard there by that. Because she would also be a witness no too, action. right? I have to wait around like everyone else. Can't even get decent food. Right after I got here, I ordered some spaghetti with marinara sauce, and I got egg noodles and ketchup. Aww. An average nobody. I get to live the rest of my life like a schnook. Schnook. <laughs> Narcotics conspiracy. 87, he's been clean. Now separated, okay. No surprise there. Died in prison, 73. That's exactly, That's exactly what, he what he didn't want. want. He didn't want to die in prison. 2004. There we go. Huh. I wonder if he got out. Damn. All right. Man, okay. I forgot it was a true story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, that was good, fellas. Yeah, I had no idea about the true story stuff like, yeah. at all going into it. There's only like two things in the whole movie where I'm like, okay, the uh, uh, you think I'm funny? Am I a clown? Do I amuse you? That's a great line. And yeah, I've heard that before, a hundred percent. And then the uh, all my life I've wanted to be a gangster. Yeah, at yeah. the beginning. Yeah. Hmm. No, I didn't really. I don't think I really recognized anything. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So it was interesting to see. There were some things where I'm like, this reminds me of like GTA Three, <laughs> and then like by the end of it with the witness protection and different things like that, it reminded me of like GTA Five a little bit. Oh, I'm sure there's like, people that made those games are like, all right, there's a lot gonna, of pools. We're gonna do Goodfellas. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do sure, that. Yeah. Absolutely. So there's definitely different elements like that that I'm like, I I feel like I recognize this from this kind of stuff. Yeah. But no, uh, it's interesting. Joe Pesci, like I, I, I guess when as the movie started, I'm like, oh, okay, these actors, this is gonna be interesting, and they kind of the ones that I thought were gonna be more prominent were more background, but uh, very effective in their small amount of time. <laughs> sure, yeah, yeah. I, I do like how Henry thinks of Joe Pesci's character, like, like mob revenge, like as he goes out, to, you know, and looks outside, he sees the gun being pointed at him, you know. It's a it's a cool look, yeah, and it's good that it's that guy, <clears throat> yeah, pulling the trigger. Okay. Sure, yeah, that's kind of how I took it. Just trying to think, like all the stuff that happened. You just it's a crazy story. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know? it feels classic. It feels like it's like what you said with GTA. Like I can kind of just like feel its influence throughout stuff. Sure. And whenever I watch stuff like that, especially something I haven't seen before. I always want to try to give it a, not a pass, but like 
the consideration that this thing pioneered a lot of stuff that I've seen sent before that. Sure. But it sure. started it, you know? Yeah. No, I get you. It's just some of the crazy stuff, like, like Tommy was yeah. just such a loose cannon. He was. And, like, whenever they said about ba- making him a made man, he was going to be a boss one day. And that kind I was of like, stuff. oh, okay. Like, but that's man, crazy just, that they would let him yeah. such a such a cowboy. Polly, right? what Polly had just said about mm-hmm. being, like, he's, he's a cowboy, he's a loose cannon, you know, da-da-da. And I'm like, they're going to make him a boss? I just can't believe it. And, and then when yeah. they shot him, I'm like, that makes yeah. much more sense. That's and it's expecting. such a... Whimpering in for him too, right? Because he is Dude, he a, he's a, he's a little lion, and like he has such an ego, and he's terrifying. He can do anything, and and he, they just he walks in the room, he dies. They yeah. fed his ego, yeah. and he was just walking in there like I'm, yep. I'm gonna be a big shot. Yep. And him walking in, be like, oh no, yeah, like realizing no one's there, and just yeah. there it goes, it happens, and it feeds in exactly with what uh, Henry's talking about, where it's like, you know, when they, you're in the business, you don't know. Who's coming to get you? Sure, like it's it's done with a smile. They're your friend, someone right? you trusted the your whole life. The thing with Jimmy yeah. and Karen, like maybe he was gonna say, "Hey, there's some dresses down there," but maybe not too, because he was like, "Hey, yeah, go get some for you, your mother, whatever. Get, yeah. Go go take care of yourself, you mm-hmm. know." And then she's dead. But that's exactly like them taking the one dude. Hey, don't worry about it. We're not gonna yeah. kill the one guy anymore. Hey, let's go go to that diner. Which diner? And then they just kill him right right there in the car. Mm-hmm. And everyone else they killed. Oh man, but they killed the one guy. And then they dug him up six months later. Ugh. Yeah. I can't imagine having to do that. Just have to spray out your car of just, like, rotting flesh. Gosh. As your kids are like, what's going on? Uh, I hit a skunk. I hit a skunk. <laughs> Jesus. No. I, I think the craziest thing for me uh, is just, like, it's like what he was saying. Like, they can, they don't, like, really come as your enemies and kill you. Like, when you're part of the family, then you need to be whacked. Like, they come as your friends and your family. Yeah. Yeah. And then kill you. Yeah. And don't it's, even think about it's it. It's like a weird thing where they're like, nobody gets to fuck with you, yeah. only we get to fuck with you. Mm-hmm. And they're like, you know, you don't, when you're going to, like, kill an animal to butcher it or yeah. something like that, you don't come with, like, a knife or a yeah. gun. You don't let them see it. You, you, you like, you walk yeah. up to them sideways and let them get comfortable so you don't spoil the meat. It's kind of like that. Where it's like... You know, you yeah, don't want I to spook them. It's you want them to have yeah. a good death, but they need to go, and that's that's the way it is. Yeah, it's real fucked up. It is. <laughs> it's like a level of mercy in a terrible game. Yeah, sure. Yeah, Ugh. the level of mercilessness. Is I was I was thinking at one terrifying. point, I'm like he's. I think Henry's gonna die, but then as I thought about it more, I'm like. But he's telling the story. So he must live, right? Like, yeah. it'd be weird to have him be dead, but he's telling the story. And I think ultimately you kind of get to the point where it's like he is writing everyone yeah, out. Yeah, the narration. What we're, yeah. what we're living through is him telling the story of everything he's gone through and what everyone's yeah. done. I now, love how it caught up to, like, the present day when he's on the witness stand telling the story to the jury, but also to the camera. Yeah. And then it moves on from there. Do you think that's to imply that the wife was also testifying at one point? Because she had, like, two very I mean, brief, like, I'm going to talk now. She was going into witness protection, so probably. Gotcha. Okay. I so think the, very likely. So probably the things that she testified about was her involvement with his, like, when he was coming mm-hmm. up through the ranks and stuff. Yeah. And their connection to, well, like, Tommy and Jimmy. I don't ever want to bust balls ever again. No. There's going to be no, my, no joking around. Friends. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, we bust balls at Blind Wave all the time, but... I knew that was the consequences. <laughs> Joe Pesci's going to shoot me in my foot. I thought Robert De Niro did a really good job. Um, mm-hmm, Joe yeah. Pesci, I just feel like was Joe Pesci. He's Joe pretty Pesci. much everything I've seen. He's Joe him, Pesci you know? through and yeah. through. Yeah. If like, anything, uh, watching this, and next time I watch Home Alone, I'm just going to be even more afraid for Kevin. Right? Yeah. <laughs> no, I feel like Home Alone. What, you think I'm funny? <laughs> <laughs> Vinny. My cousin Vinny. My yeah, you know, yeah. I feel like it's kind of the same kind of, he just, he's Joe Pesci, you know? Yeah. He's just so. such a... Like, there's no others like him. Have you guys watched the uh, the Irishman, the new movie on Netflix that With Robert had De Niro? Like, CG stuff? No. <laughs> they were both really good in that, but they were also old men acting like young men. Sure, it's not the same. <laughs> well, I mean, here at one point you have like, ah, oh, he was 21 years old. Yeah. I'm like, he he was 21 there. Yeah, yeah. like oh, right. yeah, it's fine. Who cares? The movie. <laughs> sure. I went with it. No, Sandy, I'm pretty sure... I don't think she's in Greece. Unless you said Greece because of Sandy. 
but the, I, I think just name the name. said that. Yeah. That one actress lady, uh, I'm pretty sure is in Beethoven 2 and some other things. The dog movie? Well, yeah. Not like the... Okay, uh, just say she's not that much. No, she's in some other stuff. The first time I saw... I, and I only saw woman. Beethoven 1. <laughs> just like... Oh yeah, it's our Beethoven. I recognize it's not it. even Beethoven. Beethoven two. It's Beethoven the second. Yeah, whatever. Same idea. I mean, whatever. That's whatever. the name. Whatever. No one. No one calls it that. They do. No one does. Who calls it that? Like the people that are like you know Beethoven's fifth. There's something else she's in too, and I can't. Batman it. Forever. Oh, she was <sighs> Spice. You remember uh, Two Faces like Spice and Sugar? Oh, she was Spice. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Can't mind you, spice. Say spice. Say spice, Calvin. Jesus. Zena. Jesus Christ. But yeah, no, I was just, when I saw her, I'm like, hey, I know her, but I mean, that's the thing, too. Like, this is, I mean, this movie came out, I'd have been like one year old. <laughs> what, what movie? What, yeah, what year was right? it? It came out in 1990. Yeah. I'd been like a year old or so, maybe huh. maybe two, depending on when it came out. I like whatever, how it's but. like, it came out in 1990, and they're like, you know, he won't get out until 2004. And everybody watched like, Jesus, it's so far in the future, you know? Was, like For us, it's been so far. For us, past. we're like, I wonder if he's still alive. Yeah. I was like, I wonder yeah. if he got out. I wonder if he, you know? Yeah. yeah. But, uh, no, I thought a lot of the actors and stuff did a pretty good job with some of mm-hmm. their roles and whatnot. And some of the uh, shots and whatnot. I love the oh, shot yeah. going into the Copacabana. Yeah. Yeah. I thought that was really the good. The one shot well. following them. That was really I like good. the choice of like having the gun like pointing right at the camera. I like the choice at the end with them actually speaking. I think him speaking to the camera at the end coming off the stage yeah. is like wrapping up of like I'm telling the mm-hmm. story and you're no longer watching the story. Yeah. I'm now telling it to you and we're, and it's over, you know? Yeah. And I think that's kind of a, a yeah. cool way to kind of do it. He's such an interesting witness. Like, he's... Because he's kind of an outsider looking into this world and making you understand yeah. everything, you know? He just happened to live across the street and watch these good fellas at night. The wise guys. The wise guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What all is uh, Scorsese films? I'm trying to think if I've seen very many of them. Uh, oh, Did I mean... He, the, so but, uh, yeah, shit ton. I, um, the one that I want to watch that I haven't... I think it's Scorsese. Let me check. This is the point where we all just go on our phones and everybody yep. has to watch. Wolf of Wall Street, The yeah. Aviator, Gangs of New York. Gangs of New York. So good. Casino, which I have seen. It's mm-hmm. very good. Cape Fear. Did he do Heat? He didn't do Heat, did he? Heat's always the one I hear about, too. I've, oh, never, I've never seen He did The Irishman. Yeah. The Irishman? Yeah. yeah. He did. He was my first Scorsese movie. Really? Man, you got a big list. You have girl. so many to catch up on. That's why I was wondering, because like, I always hear about Martin Scorsese and stuff like that, and like looking through his list of what he's directed, and I'm just looking at his directed stuff on IMDb, not like productions yeah. or anything yeah. else. But I, gotcha. I mean, some of these bigger ones that are like the Taxi Driver, or whatever uh-huh. it was, and Aviator, and Wolf of Wall Street, and Departed, Shutter Island, Departed. I've never, never seen watched a part of it. That's going to be on your sure. list of, like, I can't believe Aaron hasn't seen this yet. Gangs of New York, I've never seen that. Gangs of New York is fantastic as well, but for different reasons, in my opinion. So, yeah, no, I don't. I think this is my first. When we started watching, like, oh, Scorsese. Gotcha. And I'm like, what has he done? Because yeah. I don't know if I've seen any of his, mm-hmm. and this would be the first time. And, like, camera-wise, I don't know how much, I don't know what he does camera-wise and whatnot, too, but, but I thought story-wise and camera and stuff, I, I liked a lot of it. Sure, I'm not familiar enough to, to know his, like, the things that he likes to do. Sure, yeah. But, you know like I mean? when you watch like a J.J. Abrams or a Michael Bay or yeah. whatnot, you're like, I'm expecting X, Y, and Z, yep. you know? Like, I don't Lynch know what movie. to expect from him from yeah. these, so. <sighs> yeah, it was fun. I quite liked it. I thought the characters were really cool, and I'm glad to have watched it. Sure, yeah. So. I mean, it, it's also weird of like, yeah. Sometimes rooting on them, but I'm like, these are bad oh, yeah. guys. Oh, yeah. You know? Very bad. Why do people, I feel yeah. bad for this guy? Or why am I rooting on him yeah. to not get caught for this or whatever, you know? But. It, it's done well where I'm like, well, this is my protagonist for yeah. the story, but he's also, sh- they're shitty people. Yeah. You know? He's like, don't buy anything. And then he, he bought a thing, and then he kills him. <laughs> and, and I'm glad, too, like, from a witness stand perspective of it, he's telling a story, and he's like, as a kid, da da da, and he's going through it, and he's still young. And he's like, Polly never used the phones. Everyone always talked to him. He talked to people one on one, and they went yeah. and told other people, and he, he's paranoid about anyone listening, all this yeah. kind of stuff. And that's exactly what bites him by the end of everything, yeah. too. And that, Paulie, he never, was, Paulie never took calls. He always got his calls secondhand. Yeah. And when he was telling uh, Lois, Lewis, Lois, whatever her name is. Lois. Uh, you know, call from outside. I'm like, oh, no. Yeah. yeah. That's what's going to bite him, is it? She's not going to do it, is she? Nope. Nope. Can't find good help they had these a, days. They had a full... I need my hat. <laughs> it's like, what? <sighs> but no, it was, it was great. I think my favorite sequence, though, was uh, Joe Pesci 
being like, funny, what do you mean funny? Look at me. What do I look like? Do I look like a clown? Do I amuse? The way you said amuse. Do I amuse it, you? This gets me. It's good. Yeah. It's great. It's great stuff. You know what's interesting is like that's such a long scene. Yeah. And it, I feel like it doesn't really go anywhere mm-hmm. except for just setting up, like, I guess the ego on No, yeah. I mean, Tommy, I we're guess. just learning how a, a place like this operates. I mean, we're trying to teach a jury to be able to understand how people think. Yeah. You know? Sure. Ultimately. What was that noise? Skateboard. Is? Skateboard? Going over the joints in the sidewalk. Mm-hmm. What, do you think he's a wise guy skateboarding outside of the wave cave? I mean, he's allowed to do that. What, does he think he's funny? You, you, well, we're funny. Right? Are we? You think I'm funny? Yeah. Do I amuse you? Yeah. Are you amused? Yeah. All right. You're a great guy. Guys, thank you very much for checking out this reaction to Goodfellas. Uh, go over to patreon.com slash blindwave because this was actually voted on over there. So you can help choose uh, what movies that we do. Sometimes, mm-hmm. sometimes we pick, though. We're picking next time. I wonder what's going to be. Mm-hmm. Scorsese? Could Pardon. Be. Monica.